Ladies and gentlemen, please direct your attention to midfield for a special presentation of the NFL 100 All-Time Team. One hundred seasons of the National Football League. Where do you begin? Perhaps with the men who have played and coached the game. There's not enough time to thank all of them. So tonight, as we complete the NFL's 100th season, we honor the 100 greatest players and 10 greatest coaches in NFL history. Every great story needs a man in black. Or in this case, silver and black. No one has made the Raiders see red like the Kansas City Chiefs. But in the 1970s, it was the black and gold that turned the NFL black and blue. Chuck Knoll's Pittsburgh Steelers. The champions of the National Football League for the fourth time. The Steelers may have had a nation, but love them or hate them, there was only one America's team. Tom Landry and the Dallas Cowboys. Only one team was perfect. Don Shula's 1972 Miami Dolphins. We wouldn't be here tonight if not for original teams like the Chicago Bears and founders like George Hallis. Papa Bear George Hallis with the Monsters of the Midway. Or Paul Brown, football's greatest innovator. Those Browns had another Brown who may have been the best ever to play the game. This is Jim Brown, the most devastating ball carrier in the history of football. Vince Lombardi's Packers were so great, his name is etched on the Super Bowl trophy. The name of another Packers coach graces the greatest stadium in sports. Few teams dominated a decade like Bill Walsh's 49ers through the 80s. they had it easy, especially when they played Lawrence Taylor and the New York Giants. Joe Gibbs and the Washington Redskins won three Super Bowls with three different quarterbacks. Up the road from D.C., they still talk about the 1958 Baltimore Colts, who won the game many call the greatest ever played. A kid who grew up watching those Colts went on to win more Super Bowls than anyone. A kid named Bill Belichick. Some players are so great, you just have to say their first name. Reggie. Barry. Emmett. Dion. Some names just sound like football. Butkus, Seau, Schmidt, Ditka. And the NFL has given us some all-time nicknames. Crazy Legs, Slingin' Sammy, Concrete Charlie, Deacon, Night Train, Sweetness, Bambi, White Shoes, and Gronk. Football is the only game where you can play your entire career, never touch the ball, and still go down as one of the greatest players of all time. also gives us players who can do something special every time they touch the ball. Gail Sayre for a touchdown. There it is! It's a touchdown, Seahawks! Leaping catch for Randy Moore. It's solid! What a catch! Marvin Harrison! What a circus catch! Larry Lodgett does it again! Devin Hester, you are ridiculous! If you 
you want to win a football game, you also need great defense to stop all those playmakers. Regulators, mount up! Must have a kicker who can come through when everything is on the line. And it is good! It's good! Finally, you can't play this game without a quarterback. And you can't win big without a great one. One hundred years of the NFL right here on this field. Ladies and gentlemen, let's say thank you to the greatest players and coaches in NFL history. The NFL 100 all time team. What'd you think? Wow. Of How great was that? That gave me chills, Joe. The legends of the game.